Well, uh, I think we're a couple of bowlers light, so I decided to bowl first and see where we go. i uh, got full confidence in my bat lineup to chase what, uh, whatever they put up, really. So, like I said, they've been, they've been in uh, India for two weeks. They've had a good summer, so they'll be hitting the ground running. We just need to well, see, see, where we, see where we end up, you know, uh, especially without the pro and the amateur and the likes of Dishan Basher missing and Kazim Farid missing as well. So. It's a big test for us, first game. Bit of a challenge for you? Yeah, something different. I can't my club, so got a bit of experience there, but national, national level is a whole new story, so we'll see how we go. Well, what are you expecting from this game against Clydesdale? Uh, it's been a tough challenge from Clydesdale. Uh, they've got a few guys in. I haven't got a pro, though, so we'll take advantage of that. It's a nice state of play cricket, and hopefully we'll get a picture out of it. Oh, really good, uh, really good start for the boys. Chubby and uh, Freddie Coleman going really well, putting 100 together. Both pretty, well, Chubby's got his 50 and Freddie's pretty close to it, so yeah, pretty happy with that start. Uh, so what uh, total have you got in mind? Not really, not really sure yet, we just need to see if these guys keep going and keep wickets in hand, it can be anything from 250 plus and we'll just see what, what we end up on. Coming off, is that the one that was the last one to meet the 50? Yep. Shots, shots, 
first innings, I thought they batted very well. Uh, but I think the wicket's good, outfield's good, and should be a decent chase. Happy with that, Keith? Yeah, happy with that. Good start to the campaign. One out of one. Can't complain. <laughs>